Hello, in this video I am going to show you how to use the Dash Wine tool to create highly detailed scenes. Dash is a big Unreal Engine plugin, packed with useful tools to make work easier for artists. So let's dive in. The scene that you see here is from the Temples of Cambodia project, which I downloaded from Fab. Let's start by opening the Dash toolbar by clicking on this icon. Here I select the Create option, and then from the Curve tools I choose Draw Vines. I'm going to draw a curve on the wall along which the vines will appear. I can adjust the properties of the curve I'm about to draw, such as how far apart the points should be or how smooth the curve should look. I will leave these as they are for now and draw a few lines on the wall. As you can see, vines have been generated along the wall. Now we can adjust a lot of settings, such as the growth iterations, which controls the density of the smaller branches. or the growth size. I can also tweak the radius of the branches, decide how many sides the cylinder should have, and adjust how smooth it should look. I can change the properties of the leaves also. Let's replace the default dash leaves with Megascan atlases. In the dash content browser, I can see the leaf atlases that I have been downloaded from the standalone bridge software. By holding down Ctrl, I drag and drop one of them into the scene and select the place overlapped option. This brings all the versions of the leaf into the scene. While they are still selected, I add them to the leaf meshes section in the tools panel. And voila, they appear on the vine branches. I can also adjust the materials of the leaves, as they are also from Megascans. In the Tools panel, I open the list of active tools by clicking on this button, then I select the Edit Material option. Here I can modify things like Hue, Saturation and Brightness. There are other methods to create vines as well. From the Curve tools I can select the Create Vines option, and in the pop-up window, specify which surface the vines should climb on. I can also set the origin, like an empty actor, for the vines to grow from. But it's faster to select an atlas and drag it onto a mesh by holding down Ctrl. I choose the Create Vines option. By moving the actor, I can change the origin point. And the settings we used earlier still apply here as well. If you would like, you can also apply a material to the branches. I downloaded a Megascans bark material, which I will drag in. Let's change the material properties. First select the branch so Dash knows what we want to modify before opening the material edit tool. Adjust the tiling and other settings just like we did earlier. And these are the basics of the Dash Wine tool. There are so many options to fine tune the leaves and branches, so feel free to experiment. This is just one of the amazing tools in Dash. We have plenty of others to make it easier to create Unreal Engine environments. Hope you liked it and don't forget to follow us for more. See you soon. Bye.